Good morning children I hope all are keeping well even after the test and few days of holidays in limitation Last class we were discussing about programming language and what is a program what is a language is object code source code everything we explained in the last class and today we are going to see his introduction to java in this era of networks and internet all the applications being developed must have a global outlook that means it should be a general one we need software that works anywhere or any platform and with other applications as well the java programming language is a machine independent language please underline the sentence the java programming language is a machine independent language independent it is not depending on any of machine if you are writing a java program it will work in any platform or any devices also it means that the java program written on a computer will run on any other computer even if the hardware configuration or the operating system is different example if it is an dos commands mac operating system windows operating system or mobile android operating system or different platform it will work same java is an object oriented programming language developed in january 1996 underline january 1996 by the team of sun microsystem see here sun microsystem is a company headed by james goswin underline the name later on in 2010 it was acquired by oracle oracle company if you open blue j you can see this symbol this company's name in that one it creates small application modules which can be embedded into web pages these modules are called applets that enables a user to interact with a web pages most of the applications that we download on mobile phones for internet games are developed in java so not only in computers we use java to create games and that will interact in the internet also next point introduction to blue j and its features blue j is an ide integrated development environment underline what is the full form of ide Inter integrated development environment for beginners to write edit and execute the java programs so this is a very simple blue j is a very simple programs it is created for students only it allows students to write program using an interactive visual environment like all the icons images click and drag copy paste everything which gives them a good understanding of the programming concept this blue j includes an editor which you use to write a program this is an editor editor means you can write you can edit you can cut copy paste change duplicate and these all things you can do that is a that is the advantage of blue j there will be a an editor second point a debugger 
bug they are finding debugging finding the fault false mistakes a debugger to help you to find your mistakes look here here the yellow yeah there is a mistake there are different types of errors so there is an error in this line when you clear or rectify then if there is an error in another line it will show highlight and show you there is an error for that there is a debugger in blue j a viewer to see the parts of your program not only you if you give the program somebody else then they can see the viewer can also see the parts of the program an easy way to run java programs very simple no need to worry about the user this is a source code it will compile it will convert to byte code and it will run you will get the output and an easy way to view documentation if you create different object different class different projects everything you can easily okay like graphics you can see in this blue j so these are the advantages or the importance of blue j for a student now please take page number 58 starting blue j you can download blue j from internet into your computer or laptop and if you install blue j then there will be an icon on your desktop you double click on the icon blue j or you go to start if it is in any os go to start okay all programs in that one blue j select start all program blue j so any one method you can select so you select blue j i am double clicking on the icon on the desktop so first you download you can freely download there is no cost for it you can download in your laptop or computer once you open blue j you will get like this blank blank application or software then the first see fig again page number 58 figure 5.4 after opening go to project you have to create a first project and click on new project and you give okay then the first project is project is served here you see first project now then you have to create a class what is class how to create and all later i will explain just you go through how to open and page number 59 figure 58 figure 58 just you type that program first you go to new class and give a class name what is that first okay i'm giving first that is my first program is it yes so always by default class will be selected class name i gave first click on okay now here you see now the class is selected now we have to give objects so what is the object and class i will explain later now after coming here right click open editor if i click on open editor you will get another page having there are sample or templates okay of a java program what you have to do click on select all what is the shortcut key for select all control plus a then what you have to do click on cut everything has gone now go to page number 59 figure 5.8 and i am starting public class welcome onwards here i typed a small program which is there in the textbook and you see here 
downside here this corner error 2 there are two errors somewhere else where it is we don't know if there are errors means you see here it will show in the editor the error is shown like this expected the expected they are giving clues what is that expected one is this bracket once it is over now you see here served there is no error in this program after that click on compile click on compile then close then what you have to do again go to class welcome right click and click on second one void main click on and again no need to change here because already predefined then click on ok then see here welcome to world of java bluej why it comes two times because before i'm teaching you i practiced so that is why once i run and i got the output second time i run again second time you got the output clear once again i will brief how to open the blue j once again click here project you create once okay now if you want to create again project uh, no need only create class how to create a class new class and give a class name class you select okay okay then after that you right click then it is already compiled one right click open editor then you will get an editor here you write the program everything each comma semicolon then a full stop then different colors okay let it be there i will explain each one each word what it represent i will explain in the next class and click on here then compile after that compile then after compiling close again right click void main and okay then you will get the output is it clear okay then you practice how to print out your name in java just you write a small program to print only your full name continue to practice well because eight standard nine standard and 10 standard you have only one topic in computer application that is java please practice well your children take all the precautions and be safe thank you